Brian, thank you. Unfortunately, Southern Utah has had its fair share of trauma and also recovery. Yeah, and the YouTube vlogger case is the latest high-profile example. Our Brian Malahi reporting from St. George for us today. So much beauty and so many good people here, but Southern Utah has also been the place of FLDS trauma, Warren Jeffs, the Lost Boys, and natural disasters too. Joyous occasion today, a patriotic dedication of the new Washington County Administration Building. But also on the minds of people in St. George, the mom vloggers Ruby Frankie and Jody Hildebrandt, and the stunning child abuse allegations against them. It's really shocking for this community. Mitzi Eddington grew up here. The place you love, the place you know you feel safe. The case, she says, quote, affects all of us. We're outside Jody Hildebrandt's house. No activity here. There is a no trespassing sign on the garage door. Read what it was about, was horrified. Jamie Levitt is a Southern Utah mom of four. I think that's the general consensus in the in our community. Maybe it's an indication that we need to do more, like looking out for our neighbors and being a little more alert and aware of, of what's going on. <laughs> But after the band played and remarks were given in our interview, she made this observation. I think Southern Utah, there's a lot of resiliency. Another person following the case here says beneath the headlines, there are, quote, deeper institutional issues. In St. George, Brian Malahi, KUTV2 News.